Also right now, three shootings on Chicago area expressways in less than 24 hours. Our Tara Molina has been tracking this issue for years and is back on the story now that we're seeing these shootings again. She is live from the Dan Ryan and Roosevelt where we saw the first of the shootings. Tara. That's right, Erica and Jim, the first of three expressway shootings in just 24 hours in the Chicago area. The first again right here where we're joining you live off of the Dan Ryan, where we've seen the highest number of these shootings historically, including this year. Check out this video. The first scene just after five in the evening Sunday, a shooting here on the Dan Ryan diverting traffic and leading to backups into the downtown area for hours. Thankfully, no one was hurt. But about 12 hours later, a driver hurt in another shooting, this time on the Bishop Ford Expressway in the northbound lanes of I-94 near Michigan Avenue. That driver rushed to a nearby hospital. We're told their injuries weren't life threatening. A little more than an hour later, shots were fired. A third shooting. Driver shot at another motorist. Here on the Tri State Tollway near milepost 18 in Bridgeview. No one hurt. For years, we tracked expressway shootings here in the Chicago area and concerns regarding low arrests. But we've seen a decline in the crimes the last few years. With 56 shootings reported so far this year, a major decrease from the all time high we told you about in 2021. There were 109 shootings. Illinois State Police tell me these helped a lot. They're license plate readers. And according to police, they've helped identify a witness or person involved in a shooting 82% of the time this year, 100% of the time for fatal shootings. So while we've seen the number of shootings go down, the number of arrests have gone up. With 288 arrests in that worst year on record, 2021, this year, 1,249 arrests. A spokesperson for the Illinois State Police told me they didn't have anyone available to chat with us about this issue today. But again, all three of those recent shootings still under investigation. They had no comment on concerns about three of these shootings in less than 24 hours. Reporting live off the Dan Ryan, I'm Tara Molina. CBS News Chicago. Tara, thank you. 